We are going to read one odd old owl. Owl. What's the owl say? Good job. All right. In the forest of Nod, by a slumbering stream, there's a tall, twisting tree that grew out of a dream. Down through its branches, silently oozing, slid a slow, sleepy snail, disturbed from her snoozing. One odd old owl in slumber so deep is snoring so loudly the snail cannot sleep. If there's one thing snails hate, it's the sound of loud snoring. So spying two birds, she at once starts imploring. Please wake up that owl, it was time he was gone. I want some sleep, but he snores on and on. So two lazy lovebirds chirp, sheriff, and cheep, but one odd old owl continues to sleep. Louder begs the snail, much more noise if you please. So three wily woodpeckers hammer harshly on the trees. Two lazy lovebirds chirp, chirp, and cheep, but one odd old owl continues to sleep. Then, four fine feathered flamingos noisily knock their knees. Three wily woodpeckers hammer harshly on the trees. Two lazy lovebirds chirp, chirp, and cheep, but one odd old owl continues to sleep. Louder groans the snail, the sun is almost set. So five delightful ducks quack quickly in quintet. Four fine feathered flamingos noisily knock their knees. Three wily woodpeckers hammer harshly on the trees. Two lazy lovebirds chirp, chirp, and cheep, but one odd old owl continues to sleep. Snail could ooze off to bed. Fifty-five birds started snoring instead. 